What is the nature of time? What is the meaning of time? I would say that time, uh, it's like uh, the engine of a, of a motorbike uh, with all the, its pieces, right? Time is this long line, uh, this long sequence of instant. There is now, there is yesterday, there is last year, the distant past, the tomorrow and so on. And uh, we, we move, we flow through this, uh, uh, through time, all together. We're all here, we're all here, we're all here. Um, the past is very different from the future, the past is fixed, the future is open. Clocks measure time, clocks work all at the same speed. Well, all this, all this feature have a different origin. Um, and all these features are not true in general. We can take them away, we can understand where they come. They come from approximation. Uh, they are not true at the most fundamental level of nature. It's not true that the past is different from the future. It's not true that clocks go all together at the same speed. If I uh, take my, uh, my watch and I take another watch, um, they go at the same speed uh, as long as they are next to one another. But uh, if I move one up and one down, uh, or I, I, I move one fast, and the other stays still, and then they come back together. In our experience, they still indicate the same time, always, but that's only because these are not very good clocks, not very good watches. No, I don't think time is an illusion. It's a complex thing. It's not this uh, fundamental structure of reality that we think or we learn at school or we learn in basic uh, elementary physics textbooks. Uh, but it's not an illusion either, because it's, it's a reality in which we live. Is the sun set an illusion? No, because the sun goes down. But it's not the sun doing something, it's us rotating. So we understand it uh, as sunset, but we understand it as a complicated relation between our position, our motion and the sun. So the same is with time. We begin to understand it, and uh, we begin to understand it as a complicated relation between our brain and different layers of physical reality.